Right-wing organization Marco Polo has posted over 9,000 pictures from Hunter Biden's laptop online. In addition to family portraits and candid shots from ordinary life, the 8,864 photos uploaded to Biden Laptop Media. Com also feature hundreds of pictures depicting the first son using drugs and having sex with prostitutes. The pictures include 7,032 mostly from Hunter's MacBook Pro iPhoto upon 1,832 from a backup of his iPhone XS, 428 live photographs short movies made on an iPhone, 674 pictures sent through text message, 579 screenshots, 40 pictures shared over WhatsApp, and 111 more. The pictures range in period from 2008 to 2019. Geographic coordinates for some of the images suggest that Hunter shot pictures while traveling across the U.S., in Hawaii, Cabo San Lucas, Kosovo, the Dominican Republic, Western China, London, Paris, Rome, and Belgrade. All images viewed by Daily Mail. Com correspond to images from a copy of Hunter Biden's laptop that Daily Mail. Com acquired and had early in 2021 been verified by cyber forensics specialists. The most graphic nudity in the disturbing photographs was erased by Marco Polo, along with account details from bank records, credit card numbers, social security numbers, and other private data. The Bidens may still be surprised by the photograph leak, though, given it contains images of family members when they were young and others in private settings. Garrett Ziegler, a former member of the Trump White House staff, formed Marco Polo, which bills itself as a non-profit research group exposing corruption and blackmail. The American people will learn about their first family if they want to. And we won't be publishing images that portray the Bidens favorably, Ziegler declared. But he also said that redacting the genitalia from all the images took around two months. Ziegler said that after eliminating certain pictures like screenshots of Candy Crush games, the collection his team shared last week included 98% of the photos on the device. The 645-page report on Marco Polo's inquiry of the contents of Hunter's laptop was one of the ex-Trump staffers' incendiary writings that was released last October. In the explosive report, Hunter was charged with 459 charges, including prostitution violations, narcotics distribution and possession, fraud against public entities, unlicensed foreign lobbying, and money laundering. It also said that President Joe Biden participated in tax fraud, broke the Presidential Records Act, and exploited non-public information for financial advantage six times between June 2010 and December 2016 using emails and other documents from the laptop. Along with extracting and posting journal entries from Hunter's sister Ashley Biden, Ziegler also posted more than 120,000 emails from the laptop on his website, bidenlaptopemails.com. After a Marco Polo agent pretended to be a prospective ally of the first since legal defense team in a text message exchange with Hunter's Hollywood attorney Kevin Morris, Ziegler incurred the wrath of Hunter's attorneys. Morris branded the participant with asterisk asterisk asterisking moron, declared, I'm going to take all your money, and I know where you live after realizing the prankster was, in fact, from Marco Polo. You're going to enjoy being a butt boy for 20 years, buddy. Read another text. Lube up and I'm coming for you. In April, Morris filed a lawsuit against Ziegler and his nonprofit organization in a Los Angeles court, alleging harassment, violation of privacy, and criminal impersonation. A right-wing fanatic and agitator who has developed a career tormenting persons associated to President Joe Biden or his son, Hunter Biden, the lawsuit describes the 27-year-old. Ziegler is accused by Morris of conducting a harassment campaign, uploading pictures of Morris' family members on Marco Polo's social media channels while making disparaging remarks about them, and publishing his personal information on social media, including property location and phone numbers. Several right-wing radicals who follow Ziegler on social media and the website, according to him, made subliminal threats of violence against Morris, called Morris, and even drove by Morris property. Ziegler called the case utterly ludicrous and false in a statement to Daily Mail.com.
To the dismay of Hunter's legal team, a lawyer representing London Roberts, the mother of Hunter's kid, has also retained Ziegler as an expert on Hunter's laptop in her court's dispute over how much child support he should pay for their four-year-old daughter, Navy Joan Roberts. Clint Lancaster, Roberts' Arkansas attorney, engaged Ziegler to assist in dissecting Hunter's financial situation and support her in her demand for further funds from the first son, who first disputed that Navy was his before a paternity test revealed otherwise. Brent Langdon, Hunter's attorney in the child support case, contended that Ziegler constituted a security and confidentiality risk if allowed access to Hunter's private financial records and tax returns since she had no work experience as an accountant or finance expert of any kind. Additionally, Hunter's legal team has asked Congress to look into how Marco Polo acquired Treasury Department's suspicious activity report SARS which are being used as evidence by Republican legislators in their investigations into potential corruption in the Biden family. Abbe Lowell, the first since Hotshot attorney, requested an investigation into the former White House employee for allegedly violating banking rules by disseminating the private reports in a letter to the House Ethics Committee and Treasury Department's Office of Inspector General in April. The letter said that Ziegler has created a false narrative that Mr. Biden is connected to a human trafficking ring using Mr. Biden's SARS and other financial records. Ziegler urged House Oversight Committee Chairman James Comer to spread Mr. Biden's private information to a larger audience in his repeated and ongoing airing of this made-up story. Some of the SARS, produced by J.P. Morgan Bank, describe how money from Hunter Biden's business dealings with Ukrainian and Chinese firms flowed to accounts linked to him and other Biden family members. According to other SARS, Hunter paid alleged pimps and prostitutes hundreds of dollars.